What's going on guys, it's Cliffy here. Today, third place, fourth, as we take on the Storm at Amy Park. So it'll be nice to go and pick up a win against such a big side. And that there is going to help us in our quest to finish in the top eight. I think we're round, round 14 today. Uh, and it's just about origin time as well. So we've lost a few players, uh, a few good players as well, to origin camp, which is a wee bit... Well, it's a bit of a shame, you know. We've lost Pete's. Um, and I think we've lost Will Hopawadi as well. So a wee bit weaker in a, in a few departments. But hopefully it's not going to make too much of a difference. And hopefully we can still go and manage to pick up the two points here at Amy Park. But apart from that, um, not much really has changed since last episode. Because this game basically is directly after our game last week. That I think we played and lost against the Cowboys. So that was a wee bit of a shock. Um, but Thurston, put, he put on a show that game. Oh, rada rada, come on. No, Rad Radra. Come on. Get the names right. So we've got Luke Kelly playing in at half because obviously no Nathan Peets. Uh, we still have Norman, as we can see. And that's not a very good kick. But that's all right. We're going to take him just out from the 20. Um, so yeah, Luke Kelly playing in at half. Oh, that's not a high tackle. That is the first time I've conceded a high tackle in this game. So I'm pretty happy with that. But saying that, though, I mean, Origin Stars are out. So the Storm are going to be... Well, they're going to be a wee bit weaker than, you know, you probably would expect. Obviously, no Cameron Smith, no Cooper Cronk, probably no Billy Slater as well, uh, just to name a few. So, hopefully we can go and make a bit of a difference. We are only missing, I think we're missing three players, actually. I think David Lissicki, um is in camp with New South Wales as well. But, um, he for some reason, he wasn't actually starting for me. He was down, he wasn't even on the bench, he was in the subs, which I don't know why. I think possibly from last time he was on Origin duty. Um, and I just haven't gone and whew, changed him over. Reese Robinson, good tackle. I think I actually read somewhere. I think Reese Robinson is uh, is switching around to play rugby union very possibly next season. I think I read that somewhere. I can't remember who it's for. Maybe the Waratahs comes to mind. Oh crap! Oh crap! I don't know what happened there. He went for the grubber and it almost came straight back up to him. Whew, please don't make this kick. Oh, you're kidding. Who are you? Who are you? Are you Jonathan Thurston in disguise, Tahu Harris? Can be the only thing I can think of. What a kick. From the sideline and we're down 6-0. So things haven't been really... Well, they haven't really been going our way lately in this Eels career mode. We obviously picked up a loss last time. 10-6 uh, to 6 for those who haven't seen that episode. But yeah, we need to get back in winning ways. I mean, it's all right. We're still currently sitting, as I said, in third spot. No, fourth spot now on the ladder, I think. One of us. It's 3v4 today, but I can't remember who's three and who's four. I'm pretty sure we're four. We were third going into the weekend, but I think other games have been played since. So um, this has been a better set. Oh, until Harris goes and just breaks through. Only 34 metres gained. Uh, so we're going to go drop the fullbacks back. We've got the kick. Sorry, the fullbacks and the wingers. Um, so this is the new fella. Ben, ben Firmino, I think it is. So it's going to be interesting to see how he goes. Not playing a specialist hooker, which could potentially be our downfall. Oh! Now how is that not a high tackle? If my one was a high tackle, how is that one not? That's what I don't understand. I'm, just, I'm getting absolutely nailed here and the referee is giving me nothing. This is the eels in a nutshell. Just get nothing. Nothing from the refs. Oh, please. Oh, my goodness. Why can I never do that when I'm trying to tackle a guy into touch? I can never do it. Never, ever, ever. Okay, if we get a good set here, good defensive set, then uh, we're going to be looking at hopefully a kick return that we can get up to around halfway, straight off the bat. And if we can do that, hopefully we can get some points on the board uh, by, well, by the half. How did the big fella put on a step like that? How much agility does that guy have? 
Okay, so that's a good defensive set. Just seven meters gain for the storm. It's going to go back. And as I said, we want to get... Oh my god, Reese Robinson, what are you doing? Turning in this game sometimes is so difficult. Draw and pass. Draw and pass. It's what we needed. Red Radra. Under the posts. Just what we needed before half time to go and level things up going into the second half. So we've just got to make this kick, which is pretty standard and straightforward. Corey Norman with the conversion. And that puts us back at 6 6. Where we should be. I think we've... Well, maybe we don't deserve to be level. But I think we deserve some points on the board. we just got to make sure we keep hold of position here now. Don't throw it away. If we can score another try, would be bloody awesome. But I don't see it happening, to be honest. I'll try and keep it alive on the last, last play. See, again, there's another shot like that. If that was Rugby Union, that would be a penalty and probably a sin binning because no arms in the tackle. I think they're kind of trying to bring that into league as well. Like, they were going and, well, they have kind of banned the shoulder charge, haven't they? I mean, you can't really do it. It still happens. Guys just do it and basically just go to the judiciary and plead guilty and get like a game off, which I'm sure they're not really too concerned about. I mean, one game. They've got they've got big squads. Ooh, overlap. See, why couldn't he hold him up in that situation and take him into touch? Just like they did to me earlier. That's what we need. Jeez, I thought that was me playing on offense for a second there. They were just throwing it around like crazy. They're going to go... Come on, Reese Robinson. Forward. That's it. Good run. Up to the 30. That's what we need. There's only one... Well, there's not even a try in it. We're level. But one try would just go and make the difference. That's all we need. We just need one, one bit of magic. Ooh. thought he had it. I thought he had it. Oh, I held in the tackle. Uh, tap restart, please. No point kicking to touch. And with the tap restart, you take it infield a little bit too. Okay, we've got to we've got to get points here. It's not what well, is kind of repeat sets, but we've got to we've got to make something of this. We've got to get something. Just can't quite get that final ball. Just out the back. Oh, God. <clears throat> Nailed in the tackle. Right. We've got one tackle left to try and come up with something magical. And we just can't. Another high tackle. Ref, just send them off. That is two in the space of God knows how short of a time. How bloody easy was that? And we know it's a try. There's no point going upstairs for the KFC replay. But I don't even know what I was trying to do there. I was kind of trying to do... It almost seemed like a grubber. But I'll take it. Hey, a try. And we're up 12-6 to 6 against the Storm. We will, go, we will take that. We will take that. we just got to make sure we don't do anything silly now. Make sure we complete our sets. And if we do that, get the ball down in their their territory. I was going to say their position, but that doesn't make sense. Ooh. The offload there was on. The potential for the offload there was great. Luke Kelly, he's getting hammered today. Not normally a hooker. Doesn't normally play nine. I think he's a half or even a five-eighth or maybe both. Utility player. But he's just, he's getting hammered today. That's all right. Go side to side. That's what we're. That's what we're so used for. Both champions standing in touch. Couldn't tell you why. Oh, 
Oh, I, got, I thought we had numbers. I thought we had numbers. Oh, how did he get out of goal? That's I must say, that's great work there to get out of the end goal. But how did he do it? Oh, two fins in a row. Tackle him, boys. Come on, we're being a bit silly here. There's only 10 minutes left to go. If we can play out this set and not let them get too far, oh, they're going to kick. Why did you not just let it go out, Robinson? Now we're under pressure. Junior Paulo's got a neck sprain, he, so he's injured again. He's always injured. Oh my God, we're not gonna we're not gonna lose this on a silly error, are we? Surely not. God, they like to throw the ball around a lot, the Storm. They throw the ball around more than me. Okay, we just need one more tackle. That will do. That will do. Down to zero. We just need to keep hold of position. Only three minutes left to go. And we're going to come up with a win. So that should see us, hopefully, if we were in fourth, it should see us leapfrog the storm into third, potentially second, depending on other results. I was going to say, just don't do anything stupid, Red Radra. Don't do anything stupid. Don't go near the touchline. Ah! Just run it out, Corey Norman. And there we go. Match complete. No errors. We come up with the victory against the Storm. 12 points to 6. A very important win here at Amy Park. Anyway, guys, do hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please remember to leave a like. If you are new, please do subscribe. Make sure you check out my Facebook and Twitter. Links that can be found down below in the description. Hope you're having a good weekend so far. Make sure you tune in tomorrow. Double upload Sunday. Cricket coach in the morning. Uh, FIFA 16, Wellington Phoenix career mode in the afternoon. Make sure you do not miss either of those.